Get out. Tonight was a terrible service. It was not a team effort. Dana and Michelle, they're a clique. The same too. Yeah. And I don't trust them. So let me guess, me and Barbie, right? At the very beginning of your course, you said, everybody listen because I don't want everyone running around frantic. Frazzled. And then you were dick. running around frantic. No, I wasn't yes, running you were around frazzled. frantic. No, yes, I you wasn't were. frazzled. You were. That's bullshit. You were I trying to do frazzled. everything. Yeah, because y'all wasn't doing shit. Because you weren't letting us. You said, let let us. Say, no, stop. I wasn't letting you. Don't do it yet. I wasn't stop. letting you. First, don't do first, it. I gave don't you touch my stuff. Do, then I wasn't letting you. You wouldn't even let me walk the shrimp. Well, because the... you didn't have the burner on. How are you cooking shrimp? The oil Sauté was hot. Right At least the, the oil was hot. You. I was flipping them over and they were pink on that side because the oil was fucking hot. No, you were cooking with no fire, Jeffrey. Whatever. Watch that shit. Elise, I don't give a fuck if I'm you frustrated. Sorry. Don't throw no shit at me. I'm sorry. I'm tripping. Can I explain what happened on my course now? Oh, Beginning oh, of my course. Wow. Wait, Wait she's one gonna tell second. you why that's why all her it's shit was It's my turn. <laughs> Let's hear this tall so, tale. This is gonna be well, good. We need popcorn. Elise, popcorn. let her talk. Mm -hmm. My dish had 15 things to plate on. I think the main issue with your dish was that the potatoes were burnt, which it was. No, it was the distraction and just Who is the distracted? unnecessary. She's going to try to paint her like she's better than me, but we all know that no, that no, was no. the worst. Now, hold up and wait a minute. OK, I'm voting for Barbie because you needed to redeem yourself and you didn't. Elise, I'm voting for you because you would not let us help you when that's not true. you were very standoffish and defensive. I wasn't standoffish. You were. No, that's, that's why not I'm voting true. for you. My vote is for Barbie and you. Shocking. Every time I gave you direction, you came back with something and else to Jeffrey say. And you, you for all that stuff. executing what I told you to do. And it's not the first time. It's all the time with you. You can sit there, cross your arms, and shake your head. But facts are facts. Elisa and Michelle is my vote. And me? Yes, you. Why are you voting for me? Michelle, you come up with these snarky little comments at the most inappropriate time. That's why you're voting for me? That's the example right there. Oh, I can wear garnish for you, and I said, sure, that's great. But then when I asked you for stuff, oh, you know what? I just decided I quit. I did not say that. You said I can't do it because I have to cook this now. No, I did now. not. Let her talk. I'm trying to tell you what happened in the situation. Mm -mm. Yes or no, Michelle? Yes or no? Did you say it or not? I did not. <laughs> oh, fuck! She lied. Oh, oh. I did not say I'm not doing it. You did not come up to me and say, I can't do garnish for no. you. No. She just came up to me and said, can you have someone else do garnish? And you said no. And I'm like, OK, that's what fine. What the fuck does that mean? <laughs> what does that mean? No, I didn't go up to her and say, I can't do garnish. She was like, um, Barbie, I can't do garnish for you because I did um, not say I that. To... Yes, you did. I, I just realized I'm supposed to be helping Dana with the dessert. Can you have Elise do your garnish? Fuck this. Y'all are not real with yourselves. Period. Full of shit. So the answer to that question was yes. What happened? Who's going up? They're full of shit. I'll tell you what happened. I cooked to perfection for everybody's course. When it came to my, everybody fucked my shit up. She's in now, I'm not supposed to think that, that was some about sabotage. Everything. The first tray of fish came up fucking burnt. Who cooked them? Jennifer. Elise knows what she's dealing with. And to fucking play this game right now, psh, please. I am from Massachusetts, the Boston area. We don't fucking play. Yeah. Don't talk about me like I'm not I'm here. I'm talking about and you I like said, you're fucking here. You ain't perfect. I'm not perfect. But you know what? I grow from it, and I fucking know it. That's why. And I cooked to perfection for all y'all shit. No wonder it went off. And what I say. And what did you. I get in return? Nothing. But that's per usual with the red fucking team. I'm sorry. When did I fire fish? When you said to go. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I take that back. After, Andy, when did you burn it? After Chef Ramsey told me to fire the Bullshit. fish. Bullshit. Y'all are fucking full of shit. Jennifer, Red Team's first nomination and why, please? Our first nominee is Barbie Chef. The meat course was a train wreck. The potatoes were completely burnt. It was a clusterfuck in plain English. Red Team's second nomination and why? Second nominee is Elise Chef. She seemed very disorganized and frantic while we were trying to get direction. Barbie and Elise, step forward. Barbie, your team, are they giving up on you? Five minutes before it was time for me to fire my course, Michelle ran over and said, hey, I can't do garnish. And I said, no, yes, you are. 
Yes, you are going to do garnish because I need you there. I cooked your garnish. Excuse butter. me. And then I had to tell her that she was going to stay there, and then I had to make her stop with the snippy comments. All of that stuff is the stuff that interferes with the red team and keeps us from being cohesive. Holy shit. Elise, why did you deserve to stay in Hell's Kitchen? I deserve to stay in Hell's Kitchen because I started off strong. I've had some great moments here, and I'm not finished yet. Tonight, there were a few bumps in a row, but I didn't give up, and I bounced back. I kept repeating to my team what I needed to do like five, six times. It was a team effort, and I don't think that they gave me 110%. Ladies, I'm shocked at how fragmented you as a team have become. And all I get is this fight and this bitch fest. The person leaving House Kitchen is... Barbie. Come here. Barbie, give me a jacket, young lady. You've got a heart, you're determined, but you haven't bounced back, Barbie. Good night. Good night, Chef. Thank you. Thank you. Chef says that I'm not ready. Am I the worst chef in Hell's Kitchen? No. Was I the worst chef on the red team? No. But it is what it fucking is. So now, what it is is me ready to go the fuck home. Elise, back in line. Thank you, Chef. Blue team, you are on a roll. At this rate, you four may be the final four. Red team, get it together. Yes, yes Chef. Now piss off. Yes, Chef. My wildest dreams have come true, and Barbie is gone. Farewell. The only thing that would have been better is that Barbie and Elise went home, but I'll take one out of two. I'm loving what the red team is doing to each other. All they've been doing since day one is bringing each other down, and I really don't see any of them standing at the helm of Hell's Kitchen. We're at the halfway point. There's nowhere to hide. Michelle and Dana are the weakest links on the team. I think they've been skating through service. Hopefully, people who aren't pulling their weight or just coasting by will be exposed. Barbie's performance at Charity Night was a disaster. So I performed a charity act for her team by sending her home. <laughs>